Hello there. This picture is orange. It's a golden gas cloud. It's a Thargoid Titan. The Titan is the mothership of all the alien vessels. And it's one of the more dangerous places you can go to. The mothership is surrounded by a maelstrom cloud and it's huge, it's visible, it's like the size of a moon or something when you come up to it against the planet's surface. And they float round ammonia worlds. There's eight of them and they've got different names. They're all named after thunderstorms of various different folklore and myths and legends. And this picture is of the Titan mothership itself, surrounded by its asteroids and its glow. The maelstrom is quite difficult to penetrate and uh, you need a very specialised ship to do it. Unfortunately, I found that having the specialised ship that's able to penetrate the maelstrom clouds, I'm not very good at getting to the maelstrom in that ship because uh, all my utilities are stuck to it with neutralisers for pulse waves and heat sinks and all of these sort of things but what I actually need is loads and loads of weapons and a fast fast speedy ship because you can deflect as much caustic goop as you like but if you're caught by a glaive variant hunter class ship they're so fast and they're so determined to destroy you and they are so persistent in their multiple interdictions of you that it's really difficult to actually even get to the maelstrom so it's quite a challenge this whole part of the game so it's not something that I do a great deal although I'm tempted to restart because I've let it slip I've got all the modules unlocked I've got my caustic sinks equipped and I, I've got the specially adapted subsurface mining tool that enables you to drill through the surface of the Titan itself I'm just not very good at staying cold and the Thargoids sense heat I know if you can stay cold enough, you can hover around and just take in the atmosphere for quite some time because the centre of the maelstrom cloud actually around the Titan itself, as long as you're not seen by any of the defensive interceptors that float around, the actual environment, it's not too horrible and it's really pretty. So I kind of want to go back there because it is a quite an awe-inspiring environment and the sound is incredible. Overlapping noise of the honks of the Thargoids and the, the rumbling noise of the Titan itself and the blue pulse defence noise as well. It's pretty, it's all worth a tourist jaunt. So I, I'm, not, I'm not sure whether I've sold that but I recommend it as a destination. <laughs> Thanks for watching anyway. I am done. Bye.